storm. Developing tonight at 6 with the deadline. Now passed to file your personal taxes. Governor Brian Kemp is preparing to sign a bill into law that should cut the state's income tax rate. He says the move will save Georgians hundreds of dollars over the next several years. 11 Alive's Bo Beth Yates is following the story. She's joining us live from Midtown Atlanta with the details here. Bo Beth. Well, Jennifer, what if I told you I was going to give you $45? Would you be excited? Well, that's what many people will be saving that make about $45,000 on their annual um, income will be saving next year on their taxes, all because Governor Kemp is signing this new bill into law. What a wonderful moment we're in, right, where taxes are going down. Financial expert Bradley Rosen is talking about HB 1015. Governor Kemp is set to sign into law Thursday, cutting the state's income tax rate and saving taxpayers money. Right now, uh, a 5.49 rate, right, is where our, we have on our income tax. And the governor is proposing to have that reduced by 0.1% and having that continue to go down until we get to 4.99%. For a person making $45,000 a year, they will see a savings of about $45 on their 2024 income tax. Those with an income of $75,000 will see a decrease of about $75, and there will be additional savings each year after that, until the rate is decreased to almost a half of a percent, which will equate to hundreds in savings per taxpayer. But despite the small change, some in the community are celebrating the effort. And anytime you decrease taxes and tax rates and tax bases, that's, that's a good thing for the consumer. I'm glad for those that can save $200, but he needs to do more. Atlanta resident Damaris McDonald says families will see a greater benefit if the governor tackled health services like Medicaid. It's not a bad idea, but I feel that Governor Kemp needs to focus on things that will help the woman in Georgia that are HIV positive or have AIDS by expanding Medicaid. Still those in the financial sector like Rosen say every little bit helps. So while those percentages may not seem like a lot to, you know, to the average individual, obviously based on your income, a dollar saved, right, goes somewhere else to help offset all the other expenses that are going up. Now, Governor Kemp is expected to sign the bill into law tomorrow in Augusta, and a lot of people are already waiting for their check, even though they just had their past taxes done. Live in Midtown, Bobeth Yates, 11 Alive News. All right, Bobeth, thank you so much. Amazing.